Swig is one of the OTM networks that we run, which is uh, multifaceted actually. It delivers on the knowledge sharing part of things. The key reason is to develop standards. Those standards are around open interfaces for subsea wireless communications. Those wireless communications can be to do with radio frequency communications, acoustic, inductive, optical, and eventually hybrid. The vision is that an AUV would fly from uh, a field to another field. The AUV would be resident. It would be in the water for five years or more. You could use it to do inspection, maintenance, or repair at much lower cost, lower emissions. To fly for kilometers between fields, you use acoustic technology. As it nears the field and the subsea infrastructure, it would switch to optical, which is about 150 meters out. As it moves in to charge itself and to download large amounts of data, it might move to inductive, uh, where it actually docks and uh, lands in a garage and offloads lots of data or takes on lots of instruction and also charges the battery to allow it to stay underwater. And then hybrid, so you can switch from acoustic to optical, to inductive, uh, and back again as the need requires. That will only happen if there's interoperability between the different communication technologies, and that's what we're writing standards on.